afternoon, Vale. Welcome to another episode of the Vale Dailies on the Hill. I'm your host, Ross Leonard. It is Saturday, the 4th of March, the last day of the Burton U.S. Open here. And the snow is still very nice. Oh, it's warm. The sun is out. It is a beautiful day. It's been a great week over here with the Burton Open. That trick's probably like a 10 out of 10. So it's Saturday, it's wrapping up today. It's the half pipe finals. The women are going off right now. They're in their second runs. And then the men are later. But we're cruising. I think we were on Reuters Run. And we're gonna just cruise right on in and check it out. Because it's so cool, this is in our backyard here. Well, look at this little shredder. Can you say hi? Camera. Crushing it. <laughs> Good job. Oh man, you're gonna be in that half pipe in no time. <laughs> Too cool. Too cool. So yeah, we're cruising down to the top. The top of the half pipe viewing area right here. How cool is this? Looks like bib number one. This is Chloe Kim. This is Chloe Kim. Chloe Kim dropping in on the half pipe finals. <laughs> and we're still strapped in. I mean, how cool is that? How cool is that in our own backyard? Just cruise right on up and see Chloe Kim, one of the best female snowboarders in the world. Drop into the half pipe. <laughs> oh, very cool event. It's been out here five years now, and we're looking forward to it coming back, that's for sure. Do you guys know why you never play uh, you never play poker at the zoo? You never play poker at the zoo because there's too many cheetahs. <laughs> Oh man, so much fun, let's get down here. Oh, hey, thanks so much for tuning in to another episode of the Vale Dailies on the Hill. I'm your host, Ross Leonhardt, here at the Burton US Open closing day. This is the bottom area. Get on out guys, we'll see you soon.